let's make a newspaper snail. So first what you need is some scrap newspaper, um, anything will do. Um, something to trace with a cup or a small plate or something. I just have a little, I have something that's just very small so I just use that. So go ahead and trace and cut out your circle. You're going to need some crayons, crayons of any color. If you'd rather use oil pastel, you could certainly use that. Um, a cup of water, paintbrush, and some watercolor paint. We also need some scrap paper. I've got blue, I've got bright green. Um, this is a fun activity with bright colors. Um, a little bit thicker paper would be the best because we're going to make it for the snail body. And then some googly eyes and of course some glue. So the first thing you want to do with your, this is going to be the shell of your snail. So you want to take your crayons and you want to just color big designs on your newspaper. Now you don't want to fill up every inch. You do want to make sure that there is some, you know, white space in between because we are going to be coloring over top of this. So once you've just kind of done some fun designs, and you can make these bigger if you want to give um, more surface area. So once you've had some fun designs, put it on a paper plate or somewhere where you don't mind getting wet and dip into some water, get your watercolors out and just paint right on top of your crayon where you were. Remember, if you're switching out colors, don't forget to rinse out your brush. The more water you have on something, the lighter color it is. The less water, the darker the color. So just paint the whole thing, whatever color that you want, and then put that aside to dry completely, or you can dry it with a hair dryer. Once it's dry, you want to take, you want to cut out um, just kind of a basic snail shape. I kind of put it so its head is sticking up. You can just draw a little a long oval. Um, any little shape will do. Just want to make his little body. And then I'll put some glue right here. And I'm going to glue his little shell right on top. And then he needs some little antennas. I'm gonna put one here. I am gonna put one on the other side. Like so. And then I need to give uh, my little snail an eye. Get out some glue, some different kind of glue. This works better for googly eyes. There you go. And you can make a bunch of these fun little ones. You can make a little smile if you want. And then you can glue this to another piece of paper so that it stays um, nice and flat. 